Hey guys, just wanted to make a really quick tutorial uh, or instructional video. Um, I bought this PVM uh, a while back. This is the PVM 1271Q. Uh, and uh, it's uh, basically a professional video monitor, but I do have an issue in that the screen, uh, as you can see here, is shifted towards the left which means I have to play the game in kind of like a shrunken window. If I try to do a zoom out, you can see on the left hand side here, it actually cuts out a lot of the pixels and details. So uh, obviously I don't want that, so I want to shift the image to the right. But in order to do that, you actually do need to open it up and you need to do it while the machine is running so uh, the chance of electrocution is really big so do not under any circumstance do this unless you know what you're doing and feel comfortable doing it now in order to fix this uh, I actually got uh, some help online that being said what you need to do is actually really simple um, there's no knob that you can turn to adjust the angle. Instead, what you need is, let me just swivel this around, uh, have it on a little lazy Susan here, which makes it a little easier to show. But you're looking for a potentiometer on the backhand side here. And you see this little guy right there. And if you look at the side, um, I don't know if we can see that through here, but that is called the H Center 2. So basically it is the knob that centers the horizontal uh, image alignment. Uh, and that is the one that we need to turn. So uh, to go back to the front here. And uh, you can see this very well in the beginning. So uh, as soon as the title screen comes here, you can see how his uh, sword is being cut. And obviously we do not want that. So we're going to find the little knob here on the back. And we are just going to turn that. And wait for image actually to show up here. Come on. You know you want to show some pictures. There we go. And just by dialing that, you can see that we are moving the image to the right. So let's uh, reset. Just so that we can uh, see how his sword is looking right now. And see if we need to do any adjustments. So his sword is in the frame, but the shield is being cropped a little bit. So we'll just go back here and just gently nudge that a little bit here. And let's try that again. So we'll just power it on and off because the title screen is the one that's easiest to work with because you have the shield and the sword. And you want both of them to be in the frame. So let's see here. Yep, that is looking pretty damn good. So we can zoom down and zoom out. And uh, that's really all there is to it. But again, be careful because there is live current going through everything here. So uh, don't touch any exposed metal. And uh, I hope you found this uh, uh, instruction helpful 